Good morning, everyone. Uh, it is like 7.30. Uh, waiting for everyone to get up. Uh, apparently I slept diagonally in the tent, so cramped Jason up a little bit, but I'm trying to wake up, got my contacts in, looking at this beautiful view from my tent. Just trying to wake up. Gonna get some coffee and some breakfast. Uh, we're gonna go hike up to the other lake today, other, t hopefully other two lakes today. But yeah, we'll see how it goes and let's get this day started. So we've just been lounging around this morning, drinking coffee, hanging out. We're getting ready to uh, start our day hike up to Island Lake. Going a different way this time that we haven't been, so that should be fun. So we're just getting packed up. Jason's just pacing around over there, wait, waiting to go. But yeah, we're gonna filter water and then start headed out. Okay, and we just got to the new trailhead. We we're pretty certain this leads to Island Lake. We're waiting for the guys to catch up. How are you enjoying the trip so far? Hmm, not the worst. Would you do it again? Hmm, debatable. Hmm. I'll take it. <sighs> Having a fun time so far, relaxing. This is our last day here. We got one more night and we're heading out in the morning. And we're just enjoying these beautiful views here. Mountains everywhere. Oh, yeah. Love it. Kind of a decent way up the trail, not too far, but it's all a steep incline and it's kicking our butts a little bit. Yeah. Uh, kicking our butts was a good view. But it is worth it. <laughs> Took one hell of a trek. <laughs> Finally made it to Ice Lakes. Whew. We're at about 13,000 feet up. <sighs> That's hard, harder to breathe, but oh my gosh. And that, that is so beautiful. <sighs> well worth the trek and the not being able to breathe. <sighs> We're just relaxing by the lake, eating lunch, making some ramen and make some mac and cheese for Jason. And then we're gonna head to Ice Lakes again and then probably try to get to Fuller Lake after that. Alright, so we've just finished up lunch. It's not as windy up here anymore, so that's good. Uh, we did find out that we need to go 
this way, not that way up there where those people are coming from, because that would suck. But uh, taking the view a little bit more before we have to go. Finish up here, clean up, get suited back up again, finish eating, because he's not done. And then uh, we'll head out. And then we're going to be going down to Ice Lake, and then across to Fuller. We'll see how that goes. the stream over there came from that direction but came across this little lake don't have to cross any snow thankfully and the trail's supposed to go that way so let's fucking go i'm stoked it's been a good trip minus the fucking sleeping pad but um yeah we have extra i have extra food though so that's a plus About to go where we stopped last time with our packs. This time we don't have them. Right down there's Ice Lake. We've just been chilling up here, enjoying this fucking view. Look at this shit. Oh, fuck. And our camp is down there. If you can even see that shit, but it is fucking windy. Fucking reverse. I'm a little chilly. Yeah, it could be worse. Thankfully, it's not raining or anything like that. But, uh, alright, so, about to head down this, whatever the fuck it is, and then after that, it should be smooth sailing when we set. Let's do this. No, there's a little cave right there. You see that? Uh, there's yeah. a dog right there. Yeah. Huh. Dope. Alright. Some little paper calls that one. We out. Sorry, Jason. I know. You're good. <laughs> you know, if I didn't have, if I didn't have to worry about injury or death, that'd be hella fun to roll down. Oh yeah. We were immortal, yeah. Hop in with your uh, squirrel suit off of there. If you were to catch, you know, the right wind, then that'd be possible.
don't know if you can see a little tiny cover, but uh, we're gonna head up over that ridge. There should be a lake over that. See what happens. See what we find. We are gonna make our own trail. So, it's gonna be a good time. And now it's getting bright again. Might need them sunglasses. Time to lose some daylight. Yep. Uh, so we thought we had to go up on this ridge to find the lake, but came over this and boom, there's Fuller Lake right there. But we're still going out there just because why not? We got it's only four o'clock. Sun doesn't go down till at least seven, and it doesn't get dark till at least ten. So I got plenty of time and relaxing and enjoying the final night here. Making some great memories with my son. Mm -hmm. Even though he's not enjoying himself, I'm enjoying him being here. I'm glad you are. Well, I am. I'm just enjoying this beautiful landscape. Right here. Into the lake. We're gonna try and go up this ridge here and try and see how high we can get just because we can. Uh, took a bit of a fall getting up here, but almost face planted onto a rock. Caught myself though, so no, only got a small cut on my leg, nothing too bad. Right? Uh, yeah. This lake is not too far from ice lakes. And a lot closer than we anticipated. <laughs> yeah, very short trip. I think if you have an extra 20 minutes, you want to hit this lake. If you're ever up just going up to uh, Ice Lake, it's worth the extra few if you want to make it. <clears throat> of course, snow allowed us to this time. Right. But, yeah. Man. Now we're just going to go explore and climb up stuff. Yeah, better get after it. <laughs> or, yeah. Better catch up. so damn beautiful it is windy though but we vibe we vibe yeah ice lakes down here and then fuller lake here and then we're going up here to where that waterfall's at up here we're, at least we're gonna try to <laughs> on top of a mountain and it feels great. We made it to the top. Yo, it's solid. It's fucking amazing. Hungry again. <laughs> right. Same here. And these nice views. Look down a giant waterfall, side on the edge of the waterfall. Yeah. yeah. Gonna head around one more bend, see what's on the other side of the mountain range, and then I think head back we'll down. head back down. Call it for the day. Uh, so what time is it? Uh let's see. We're at uh, 4 53. So you still have several hours well of daylight. But we'll get down, we'll probably get back to camp about 7, 7.30. Easily. And we'll filter water, then cook dinner. So, yeah, it should be a good night. This was a beautiful daylight. Oh, yeah, it was. Camping <laughs> to spend the extra time up here. Yeah, it was. But as you saw, we had a pretty lazy morning. So, you know, if you're really committed, stay overnight in the town, perhaps. If you're out of state, here, you yeah. Love it. Oh yeah. We found a gopher village. Yo, why is there a barrel there? 
I don't know. Let's go check it out. There's a fucking random barrel up here. Found a barrel. Sliding my feet along the trail I took before. Little did I realize this step really precarious. <laughs> Almost fell right through that. shit up here but uh we move it's beautiful there's so much left to explore but not enough not enough daylight so here's what it is Christ uh, my feet hurt really badly so I'm soaking them in this cold water and it's fucking freezing Woo! Good. <laughs> oh my god. Get on the dirt out. Ah. Yep, that's it. Uh, I can't do it anymore. Oh. said see you back at camp all right and we're back at camp <laughs> set up cooking dinner for tonight about to tuck in probably pretty early sun's already gone down beyond the mountains but it's not gonna get dark again till real late probably 9 30 stars will start coming out Real excited for it. But we're out tomorrow. So let's tuck her in, get some of this food on, and get to bed.
See you in the morning. Okay, and just like that, we're all packed up and ready to go. Most Chris, of us are still here. Most of us are still here, unfortunately. Uh, with Chris's pad deflating all night, he uh, had some really bad back pain this morning. It was not good. So we're just gonna, we got up early. We're booking it, just gonna book it on out of here and try to make some good time going downhill. Got any thoughts? Well, this was an absolutely beautiful trip. Insane views. I'm so glad I came Oh yeah. this time. Uh, I can't wait to do it again. Next time, we're gonna make sure Chris has a better sleeping pad. We're gonna take your tips on sleeping pads. I'll send you the link to that. Uh, Perhaps you'll have a video coming out about that soon. Oh yeah. Maybe. Um, and uh, I know we all have these Osprey packs on. <laughs> Another video coming about that soon. Making you do some work, Travis. I'm gonna do a gear video <laughs> here soon. I just gotta buy one more piece of gear and then I'll be fine. I buy a chair. <laughs> sure, sure. That's what we all say. Just yeah. one more piece of gear. Just one more piece of gear. I swear, I swear. I'm not addicted. It's fine. <laughs> just one more piece of gear until I find something I could lighten up my pack with. Well, how'd you thought? How'd you like it? Colder than I'd prefer. What about the views? Mm, not bad, honestly. Oh, good. Nice. Yeah. Well, I'll, not bad. I'll take it. <laughs> <laughs> See you at the bottom of the mountain. Yep. I'll do. These are beautiful. I'm not gonna deny that. Nothing is on the camp. We're good. Beauty of the hike out, it's all downhill. No uphill today, so we should make pretty good time and be off the trail soon, hopefully. It's only like two or three miles ish, so not too bad. <sighs> I think it was about 8.30. It's 8.30 like now. Start really got on the trail? Yeah, well, I just checked. It's 8.30 now, so it's like 8.25, 8 8.20. Yeah. That works. Okay, we made it back. I can see the car from here through the trees. It's a beautiful hike. Uh, please like and subscribe to the video and my channel. To I've got plenty, a couple big trips coming up this year. Um, this is just first of many. If you please enjoy the images that um, I put at the end of this video from the trip. And goodbye Ice Lakes for now, and we'll see you on the next adventure. Bye everyone. Enjoy.